Okay, so now I'm going to add my green. My green. You can't even get it. I just can't <laughs> stop thinking about it. Because I'm a good person. You know what I mean? And I'm thinking to myself, but if you only knew who I was, you wouldn't think that about me. <laughs> but you don't even know me. That's how, like, we judge each other every day. Like, we just look at each other and just be like, oh, you must be like this. Okay, and, well. and then I started thinking like this. From It took him all the time to walk across the parking lot. And while he's doing that, it's other cars driving all around. Like, are you angry at them, too? <laughs> because... Technically, you had a better chance of getting hit by them than me because I'm already parked. <laughs> like, gee, why? Why? I did nothing to you. Well, I guess I take back what I said about handicapped. Some handicapped people. I'm going to pray for him tonight because his mind is not right. His mind wasn't right. His mind wasn't right. You know what I mean? So I ain't even get mad. I mean, I wasn't even really offended for real. For real. Really, I didn't even know he was talking to me. I Storm a purse up, you know, and I just happen to, we just happen to catch eyes. He said, I hope you get, I was like, oh, Jesus, why, Lord, why, Lord, why? I didn't do nothing to the handicapped man, Lord. Oh, man. Like, I would never even do, you know, like I said, even if I knew that he was talking to me initially, which I'm, I'm so like, I'm thinking about everything else I got to do. I wasn't even worried about him after I knew. That's why he was already getting off the curb. I pulled him to my spot. He, like, left my mind for real, for real. And so I saw he was parked right beside me. The only thing that made me really realize that because the van was so beat up and old. And I was looking at it like, and it not only was the van beat up and old, like, it was parked, like, real stupid. Like, and I remember looking at it like, I probably shouldn't even park beside this van. Whoever parked here obviously can't drive real good because it's all messed up and parked crooked. But I was just like, let me just pop. You know what I mean? That's really what even made me realize, you know, realize the van. And I see D, and I'm like, okay. Again, not even thinking I did nothing wrong to even apologize for. You know what? Like I was sitting in the car because I felt that. Well, oh, I almost hit the handicap. Right. Ride. It wasn't even like that. He was just like, I think he really was just already having a bad day. Like. He just wanted to blame you for his I know. I, hope he, I was like, Jesus. <laughs> please tell me why this man is. Wishing this on me upon my life. Oh my goodness, that's just funny. I don't know. That was that was just a funny little story. I thought, cause I just couldn't believe it that he was acting like that. Like, dude, you already handicapped. You gonna wish stuff on somebody else? You just expecting more stuff to happen to you. <laughs> I don't do that to people for real. I don't like that. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna stop talking about the handicapped man. Cause now now I am starting to get upset. You know what I mean? I am starting to get angry because it's like I'm not that kind of person. <laughs> I don't even have to justify. I'm not even going to. I don't have to justify my. I ain't got to explain nothing. We're going to finish nails. <laughs> All right. So, here is. Look at that. See how they bring that out? I love that, man. I love that. I really do. And then you just want to scatter those little petals all about. Let me put one right there. Oh, man. Crazy craziness. <laughs> I didn't even mean to interrupt my, my nail tutorial to do to say all that. It just, you know, it messed my head up for real. Like, <laughs> you know. It's called the comedy hour. You know what, man? That wasn't even funny. Like, it wasn't funny how he, he just pegged me to be a bad person like that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. You already obviously got all these issues going on with you. I don't, I'm not even going to talk about it no more because, like I said, he wasn't really in his right mind, I don't think. This is like real unfortunate that he picked me of all people, like, you know. Put me some good TV. And then, like, a part of me wanted to go back out there and say to him, "I wasn't trying to hit you." You know what I mean? But it was like, why? Why are you even doing it? Like, first of all, they was probably gone by then. Okay. But now we finished our design. And I'm gonna put some rhinestones on. I know we don't put rhinestones on anymore. I used to be back in the day when I had no kids. When I had to wash no dishes. <laughs> My rhinestones just be tight for like two weeks. But these care, days, I don't even do designs anymore because my kids don't let me. But since they're asleep tonight, I'm going to do it up and put designs on and everything. So let me show y'all how to put the rhinestones on. Alright, so um, this is Top Coat and this is by Beauty Secrets. This, make it, this makes it real glossy. I like this. 
Alright, so what I'm going to do is put a little dab of it wherever I want my rhinestone to be. And look, here's my rhinestone. I'm using my orange wood stick. I'm going to use one end of it and just dip it into where I just put that top coat just to get a little bit on there. Put it on the rhinestone. The rhinestone should be faced up. And I'm going to take the rhinestone and give it a little tiny press and press it right on a little dab of what's it called? Top coat. <laughs> it's late y'all, I'm sorry. <laughs> of the top coat. And I'm just going to repeat it for wherever I want my rhinestones to be. I'm only going to put like, I don't know, I start off with just doing two each nail or something like that. But um, I'm just going to do one and show y'all. I'll put one more on there. I get carried away with the rhinestones because I love that. Bling, bling. You, you get carried away a lot. Okay, so. And some people use glue. Nail glue. They take a dab of nail glue and put that on rhinestone on there. And that's cool too, but the only problem I have with that is the rhinestone is going to come off at some point. You're going to do something, bump against it, it's going to come off. In my experience with the nail glue, when that rhinestone pop off, so do some of that design. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't like that. So, I mean, I don't know if that's ever happened to any of y'all before, but it's happened to me on several occasions, so I just don't like these. I don't like these. Because, I mean, what's a pack of rhinestones, like a dollar? Like, seriously, if you lose rhinestones, you, you can just, like, go buy some more. But you still have a design, so it's, to me it's worth it to just buy an extra pack of rhinestones <laughs> in case you need to replace, you know what I mean? So then, after you put those on, then you just want to take your top coat, go over the whole nail, Make sure you pay special attention to where the rhinestones are. 